Howdy. Howdy, partner. Um, this is going to be five bands or musicians that suck. Part three. I've already done part one. I've already done part two. Actually, let's do a recap. What do you what do you think? Let's do a recap. Part one was Guns N' Roses, Green Day, Nirvana, Pearl Jam, Ramones. Part two was Michael Jackson, Metallica, Nickelback, Devil Wears Prada, and John Lennon. You know something that's really surprised me from part one and part two of five bands or musicians that I hate or that I think is really underrated? Um, I was actually quite surprised on how many people agreed with me or have agreed with me so far. I, I actually wasn't expecting that. I thought I did get a little bit of hate, but not that much, actually. The majority of people actually agree with me, and it was like, you know something, you're right, he really does suck, or they really do suck. So I was actually quite surprised. I'm glad. Thank you. Um... I'm thinking about doing something. I'm thinking about doing two things. I'm thinking about doing a special edition, five bands or musicians that suck, subscriber edition. There's a couple of people already that told me what bands or musicians they think really suck. And if I get a couple more people to tell me what really famous musicians or bands that's super famous, that they think suck, I'm going to do a, a five bands or maybe even ten bands or musicians that suck subscriber edition. What do you think? Let me know about that. Let me know what you think about that. Um, so if I have a couple more people to tell me bands or musicians that they think suck, I'll go ahead and do that subscriber edition. Um, also, I'm, um, I'm actually also thinking about doing a opposite of what I'm doing now. I'm thinking about doing one or two videos of five bands or musicians that I think are really underrated and not appreciated um, musicians or bands that I love that a lot of people do not love. I'm thinking about doing a couple of those also. Anyway, let's get started. Um, this is uh, five bands or musicians that I think suck or or are really overrated. Let's go with the biggie first. Ozzy Osbourne. Before you make any comments, hear me out. I have a reason for for putting Ozzy Osbourne on this list. I don't really have anything against Ozzy Osbourne, but I think he is extremely overrated and I'll tell you why. He used to be the lead singer of Black Sabbath, and I used to be a humongous Black Sabbath fan back in the, uh, um, from 79 throughout the 80s. I used to be, a, I had, I think I had like five or six Black Sabbath albums. I was a huge Black Sabbath fan. From the very first album, I had Technical Ecstasy, Sabotage, all of them. Ozzy Osbourne got kicked out of Black Sabbath for being a jerk hole. Um, he was out of control. Um, he was doing a tremendous amount of drugs and drinking a lot of alcohol, getting in trouble. He was out of control, basically. So that was like, see ya. So he was on his way to dying, in my opinion. I think he was really close to dying in a hotel room from OD. Um, Sharon Osbourne, before they were married, her name was not Sharon Osbourne back then. Um, I can't remember what her maiden name was, but they are married now. Ozzy Osbourne and Sherry Osbourne are married now. But a long time ago, when Ozzy Osbourne got kicked out of Black Sabbath, Sharon comes swooping out of nowhere, picked him up, carried him away, got him a bath, made him quit drinking for a while, made him quit doing drugs for a while, saved his life because he was almost dead from OD. So she saved his life. And then after he got straightened out a little bit, she started his career. 
She became his life coach. She became his business partner and um, manager, basically. She managed every part of Ozzy Osbourne's life. Started getting him record deals, started getting him gigs, um, started getting musicians together to play with him. And I think Ozzy Osbourne is a pretty good singer, but as far as a musician, I don't think he's that much of a musician because the only thing he does is really sing. He's done some lyrics but he only sings and he's just okay singing. He's not like a fantastic singer or anything. So I think he's gotten credit for his entire career. And I think all the credit, almost all the credit should go to Sharon Osbourne. That's my opinion. Because if it wasn't for Sharon Osbourne, he would have no career at all. He would be dead. And if he didn't die, he probably wouldn't be anywhere close to what he is now. So that's the reason Ozzy Osbourne is on this list is because he's extremely overrated. All the credit should go to Sharon Osbourne, in my opinion. Next, Motley Crue. Um, basically, I just think they suck. Um, they're okay musicians. They're... Um, a 1980s a lot of people classified them as metal they are not metal they're not true metal they are poppy glam hair hard rock at best but i think they're just a mediocre band next same with poison exact same thing i think poison was a glam band um, semi-talented musicians. Um, I hate, I hated C.C. DeVille, the lead guitarist. I could not stand him. I did not like him. Um, I just think their songs and their lyrics just were crappy. Um, I was a humongous Tesla fan back in the 80s. Tesla opened up for Poison. I saw Tesla, they kicked butt. Poison come on, because they were the headliners. This was Asheville, North Carolina, back sometime in the mid 80s, somewhere like that. Um, I saw them in Asheville, North Carolina, where I'm from. Poison got on stage, and it's just like, I just sat there the whole time, like, these guys suck. I don't like them. Um, next, Rod Stewart. Boring. Um, he can. S he's not that great of a singer. He's been around for a long time. I have a lot of respect for him because he's kept up. He's been around for a long time, and he's made a career for himself. But overall, I just don't like his music, and I think he sucks. Next, Rolling Stones, one of the biggest bands in the entire world. I can think of two songs that I thought were pretty decent. Other than that, I didn't like them. It's nothing against them. I think they're good musicians. Um, I don't think Mick Jagger is that great of a singer, but the musicians themselves, um, I like them for their talent, but just overall, I just didn't really particularly care for them. That's it from my list this time. I'm making it sort of short. Uh, but let me know what you think about the uh, Five Bands or Musicians subscriber edition. And uh, tell me what bands you think suck. And also tell me what um, fragrance you're wearing right now while you're watching this. I just got this in the mail today. Um, I do not do clones anymore i stopped buying clones but i did not buy this one one of my really good friends bought this for me i have i have three other green irish tweed clones and i thought i think they're okay but this is another clone of green irish tweed and i think this is by far 
the best, even though I do not do clones anymore. I got to admit, this is actually pretty dang good. This is really super close to Creed. Um, LaVenture, Night by Al Haramain. Um, this is actually pretty good. Um, so tell me what you're wearing, and I will be back sometime with something else. I have no idea what I'm doing next. But anyway, stay tuned. Love you guys. Bye.